This program contains some material that many parents would not find suitable for children under the age of 14. Viewer discretion is advised. I might have to cave and get that son of a beach. All right, well, I'm gonna continue looking around with Jorge and uh, scratch my head a little bit and figure out what I wanna do with my life. He's gonna buy it. Decisions must be made. everybody it is Saturday and we are back on the hunt and uh, starting off this hunt on the right foot because I'm here right now getting ready to go into bits and buttons and uh, see what they got so hope everybody's having a great day let's go hunting as we're inside right now here's some GI Joe stuff looks like you got some newer newer vehicles in which is kind of cool uh, got some classified. We got our turtle stuff, which is cool. Got some unpunched turtle. Is that shooters? It's interesting. Where do they shoot marbles? It's got the classic collection. It's got the three zero, the mutations. Here's some more retro, retro ones. It's got Shredder and the Foot Soldier, Super Sevens. Here's the uh, three and three quarter Star Wars. Here's the stuff inside the case, which is always the good stuff. It's got a loose Mando, IG-11. Got Luke, got Leia, we got Obi-Wan up there. There's another Obi-Wan. I always say that about that Rex, it's so cool. Packaging on that, got a Wampa. It's Darth Sidious. Greedo. It's cool stuff. Got a bunch of Tuscan Raiders. Imperial Death Troopers. Got Lando. Spoke Tan. Saj. Aurora. Jar Jar. Cool stuff. It's got some patches. Got Gizmo. Oh, it's an air freshener. I wonder what that would smell like. What would Gizmo smell like? What is that? What is that? What do you got, Arch? What is that? These are pens from Australia. Oh, good day, mate. Uh, oh, they're coming from down under. We had them this morning. Oh, what? They all sold out already? Wow. Here's a. Uh, Marvel stuff, got some Toy Biz. Now they got the uh, Fantastic Four retro set in, or some of it. What do they got? Just some of them left. There's the Webman, there's Tigra. He's got the Mondo Catwoman. He's got some Hot Toys, some statues. Uh, let's see some more Marvel Legends. Here's some of the uh, McFarlane pieces. Of course you guys know here's all the wrestling stuff which is cool got gangrel the triple h yeah got stomps got bone crunching bad boys got some of the classic superstars the titan tron might have to grab one of those titan trons just for that that vince figure that's in there uh we got some elites Got Liv, Ricochet, Big Show, Bray, Rhea, Dusty, poor Keith Lee. Uh, let's see. Got a Ziggler, we got Goldust, Cody, El Torito. Got a Luchasaurus. Got some Lucy's, some of the Hasbros, Earthquake and Typhoon, the Mountie. Million Dollar Man, Ultimate Warrior, Rick Skiner. I think what are those? The uh, the Head Shrinkers. Got the Tonka. Got Skinner. IRS. Owen Hart. Razor. Got some basics and elites in here. Oh, look at that, Vince. 
That's a cool Vince. Got superstar Billy Graham back there. Got Dean Malenko. Bret Hart. Jim Neidhart, the boogeyman. There's Ken Shamrock, Al Snow. Bellas. Oh, the Macho King with the crown and the scepter. Son of a bitch. I might have to get that. Yeah, I might have to grab that Macho King with the, with the scepter and the crown. Holy crap. I uh, got Legion of Doom. Got Giant Gonzalez. Coco Beware. Got Sid Justice in the back. Ricky Dragon. Undertaker. Shawn Michaels. Mr. Perfect. Uh, we got some. The Wall of Migo over here. Here's some more hot toys, some statues. That Red Hulk is pretty sick. Here's some loose figures. Got some legends. Some DC stuff in here as well. Pretty cool. Of course, here's all the pops. Case Queso pops. Oh, this is cool. It's got the uh, Prime 1 uh, Arkham Knight Batman. And of course, he's got the uh, Nightfall. Asriel Batman, Prime One pieces. God, that thing is so huge. Here's some Legos. Anything I'm interested in? Uh, I don't see anything. And they got Vader's Chamber. That's kind of cool. Uh, there's the uh, the Nintendo system. All right. Uh, let's keep looking around. See what else I got. Some uh, some NECA stuff. We got some Nightmare Before Christmas figures we got dark lord boglins oh this he's got the mondo uh, godzilla statue that he's got right here this thing is pretty freaking epic that is so cool uh what else do we got got some predator kill bill jane silent bob robocop he's got a whole bunch of turtles and time stuff that came in some toonie terrors gremlins so all right, well, I think I'm going to grab that Macho King, so hang tight. Bear with me. We'll be right back in a moment. All right, guys, so I'm done at Bits and Buttons. I snagged the Macho King only because you never see it with the crown or the scepter, so it was a good price. Couldn't pass it up. However, I'm here right now outside of Tate's, and inside of Tate's is a special guest that's waiting for me. So let's go inside. Let's see who that guest is, and let's see what they got. All right, guys, so I'm here right now inside of Tate's and the special guest I mentioned, the one, the only, the Medina Lorian. What's up, ba, ba, ba. He is in his element right now. I am in crisis. Oh, it's because okay, so let's see if we can help you with your crisis. It's my birthday weekend. Yeah. My birthday weekend, my birthday month. Two they weeks. Give you, two weeks. Two weeks, yeah, but they give you a 20% coupon at the store all month long, right? And then Seth tells me that they had a huge... Yeah, they got a restock. restock of Star Wars stuff. So now I'm down here, and I don't know what to get. It's because I'm sitting like, eh. Well, 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 let's see. Let's see. So here's all the usual commemorative plates and all the stuff we yeah, ever see. But here's a Obi Wan. Right. This is the Mythos. This is the Mythos. mythos six scale. Which is cool. Which is cool. But I have a Mythos. Statue, we got a so like, we got a Vader. Yeah, it's Sideshow Vader. Um, and then here's the 501st Battalion. Right. Standard. The Coruscant. The Coruscant Guard. Scout Trooper. Right. I think this is the Boba Fett that comes with the Sarlacc pit. Pretty pricey. The uh, Return of the Jedi, Jedi Luke. Sideshow version. Sideshow version. You see the porch is kind of mad. Yeah. And then we got... The deluxe version got of the, the Mandalorian with, with and the, the with, with the prim. The prim. And then the regular Anon. version of that. And you got Lando in the back. got Lando in the back. Yeah, that's, those, are tough, those are tough decisions. You got a lot of pieces. You know, looking, looking at all these right now, the one that... Oh, the, and then... Oh, yeah, all the busts. Oh, yeah, the bus oh, yeah all the busts. Because I've been wanting the Shea Vizsla. Yeah. But they don't have the box for the Shea Vizsla. Yeah. But she's a Mando. And right? they got a Sabine. And they got a Sabine. So I'm thinking I get two of those. Yeah. And, but, then, and then they got a Saj. The Saj. They just got the Saj. Now, look at the portrait on the Saj, right? Don't they look kind of weird? Yeah. Okay. But then you see this, and it's like, does that look like that? No, it doesn't. Not at all. The lips, it's the mouth. Yeah, something doesn't seem right. You know? But if out of all these that we just mentioned, you know, the one that, that's actually kind of piquing my curiosity and interest the most mm. is the Obi. I have a Mythos Obi. 
You have a statue. Mythos Obi. Yes, a very nice one. <laughs> that thing is good. I don't need to replace that with anything else. So I guess what, we're talking either about the Scout Trooper or the Coruscant card? Maybe. The Scout Trooper is way more weathered than, than the one that I have. Well, because that's the one from the Mandalorian from the Mando. show. Yeah, it's way more than the, the Sideshow one that I have. And I kind of want to get the new Hot Toys one with the Scout, with the bike. Yeah. But I would um, hold off on the one with, for the bike. For the one with the bike. A bike and then you know, I, I would, I would get, to see what I would get do. Your, I would get yourself a Coruscant card. He just looks so happy in there. And they got some vehicles. Yeah, they got some vehicles. They got some vehicles too, which is kind of dope. Yeah. They got um they got the Lego. Oh, and they got more vehicles over there. Yeah, oh, and with the pa with the packaging too. Yeah, some of them. Jeez. They got some older ones. And they got an Novo Novos helmet? Yeah. Was that a first of the first, first order? order? Yeah. No, I don't buy that. Got the Cantina band. Ding, 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 ding. This is good. Yeah, we've seen that a few times already. The Legos. Indiana Jones doesn't belong here. Yeah, right. Did you see that, that uh, picture that they posted the other day where you had... Uh, oh, yeah, when Han Solo was... Uh, where where uh, Indiana, Indiana Jones, Jones was standing over the car car yeah. night, and he's like... Oh, yeah, yeah he's like seeing himself in Carbonite. That's funny. We got the Kit Fisto. We got a Soka Tano. We got a Saj Ventress. So, all right. We're going to continue looking around and catching up with George. But they also did get a restock on Marvel Hot Toys, so we're gonna have to check that out. I think the whole store got restocked, so just bear with me. I just hear some DC figures right now. We've got the uh, Black Suit Superman, Justice League Batman, some cool pieces. Here's some of the uh, DC collectible figures. There's the Bat Cycle. There's a Superman versus Earth One Batman, but technically Doomsday. Um, Oh, they got the uh, the Winter Soldier shield, which is cool. Got some Lucy's. Got some Hulk stuff, which is kind of cool. That's cool. I haven't seen these before. There's some Diamond Select Marvel stuff. There's some Marvel Legends. Got Black Cat. They got the uh, What If. Oh, they got a Miles. Oh, look at that. Shit. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. They got Thor. Oh boy. Yeah, we might. We so some 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 decisions are gonna have to be made. Not favorable ones though. Um, let's see what else have they got. Uh, here's some more Marvel stuff. They got the uh, Silver Surfer. Uh, what is that? Galactus with the Silver Surfer. The Black Light one, that's cool. Yeah, they got the Iron Man from Iron Man 2 with the Gantry. We got some other uh, stuff over here. What's up, Jorge? Hold on. Okay. Packing up my, uh, my figure. Got some uh, more Marvel Legends. Got some stuff over here. Dude, that... That, um, what? This. Oh my God, man. What am I looking this at? Is, oh yeah, the Hydra Stomper. Like my favorite. Yeah, Marvel Legend. Marvel Legends yeah. ever. <laughs> yeah, but I can't bring myself to, to do that. To do that at that. Uh... But they still have it at Target. Yeah, they have them at Target. They have them at Targets and Walmart's, dude. Target. I like it. I don't know. I m I might suck it up because I need it. I like it just because it's 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 a really cool looking Iron Man figure and it's big. I know. Well, it's, it's not. It's it's a Hulk. Let's call it the fir Hulkbuster version one. Okay, because that's technically what it what it what it is in the what if world. Oh yeah, but I was just saying, it looks like an Iron Man. Figure. Yeah, it looks like a like a like a World War II style Iron Man figure, and and again because it's the scale, it's it's a big. Yeah, they piece. got they got a bunch of things I want right now. I'm having a hard time trying to trying to figure it out. I finally made my decision. Here's some here's some wrestling some wrestling figures. See, I need this I need this Ultimate Warrior, but I can't I can't bring myself to pay that because I can get it cheaper at, at bits. I'm just staring at Castle Grayson. Oh. There. Yeah. Uh, got some Transformers stuff over here. What else have they got? They got some Super 7s. They got some Bucky O'Hare figures. Some ALF air fresheners. I wonder if it's good after all those years. Some more Transformers stuff. There's that Shattered... Optimus Prime, which is awesome, but I but I technically already have that Optimus Prime, so it's like I, think it's dope. I know, but it's like I already have that Optimus Prime. Why would I want to buy it in a different color? Let me just put it this way, dude. I was looking in this direction, yeah, and that this is what caught my eye. I know, <laughs> I know. 
Uh, here's some Masters of the Universe stuff. Metal Gear figures, wow. We got Solid Snake down there. I remember all this. Dude, Metal Gear Solid was like my favorite game. I'm surprised you didn't mention that yesterday when we were talking about Nintendo games. Yeah. Well, because I didn't play it on Nintendo, I played it on uh, PlayStation. PlayStation. Okay. Yeah, Here's dude. some three and three quarters. What else do we got? Here's some more wrestling stuff. Anything interesting? They got a Braun, they got a Cesaro, they got Sting, they got JYD. Here's some bone crunchers loose that they have. Here's some comics. They got the chase versions of the uh, the multiverse uh, Batmans. He's Dude, I want that whole bowling ball. <laughs> that thing is awesome. <laughs> that thing is awesome. You know, I didn't even put two together that was a bowling ball. When I looked down, yeah, it was a bowling glance, ball. It looked like one of those... Uh, those uh, madam balls or whatever. Oh, they, like the mystic, the mystic thing. ball, you know? No, nah, dude, that's a freaking bowling yeah. ball, dude. It's awesome. Yeah, it's pretty dope. Got some Black Panther pieces. These Iron Studios X. -Men. Oh, these are that. Oh, these are the ten, the ten scale ones. Yeah. I've never, I haven't seen them in person yet. No, they, they look. Oh, that big. pyro one looks dope. Yeah, Colossus looks freaking dope. Uh, I don't He's know. The face, about? the face looks a little weird. Oh nah, man, that's a lot of expression for a ten scale piece, man. The saber tooth and the pyro look really dope. The pyro I'll give looks it. Dope. I'll give it that. And you got him throwing like a sentinel. On? That's dope. I got some Iron Man stuff, Daredevil. I always like this rocket, this little mini rocket bus, because he's like giving that look, look like he's up to something, but you don't know exactly what. Yeah. Let's see what else do we got? Got some DC stuff over here. There's Bob. Is that Constantine down there? There's Bob. That? No, that's a Preacher. Preacher. Uh, let's see. Yeah, nothing. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. We got some of the uh, Toy Biz. Uh, Superhero friends, and then of course the Hot Toys case. So they got Mark. I have this Iron Man. I have this Iron Man. They got a restock on the Punisher War Machine. They got Thanos. Yeah. It's just the Mark Seven in in the gold suit. The Mark Seven in gold. Yeah, it's the, basically looks identical to the Mark Seven, but it's just gold. Why they buy that's the Mark, Iron Man 3. Yeah, I know, but I'm just saying the style yeah. of the suit is okay. Mark 7, but it's just gold. But then they got this this thing over here. in the movie? I don't think so. Okay. And they got this over here that, like, I desperately, desperately want. Oh, yeah, that's nice. It's Miles Morales. That caught my eye, too. Actually, that yeah. caught my eye first. Yeah. I might, have to, I might have to cave and get that son of a beach. All right, well, I'm going to continue looking around with Jorge and uh, scratch my head a little bit and figure out what I want to do with my life. He's gonna buy. Decisions must be made. All right guys, just left Tate's. Decisions were made. Um, George bought something, but I'm sure he'll show that to you guys at some point. Um, I gotta figure out where I'm gonna go now or if I'm gonna head back home because it's getting late and I've gotta go film the first podcast with uh, Captain Powerlift for the Wrestling Channel. So. Um, I don't know. So you either might see me at one more place or you might see me at home. Um, either way, stick around. It's going to get interesting. All right. I decided to give you guys one more stop. So I'm here right now outside of a Walmart. We're going to go inside and see what they got. Hopefully some some new stuff because, you know, we're looking for new stuff. Guys, we're down the figure out right now. There's uh, Optimus Primal. Got some of the red series. We got Thrust. We got Blur and Cup, Sideswipe, Cheetor. There's a Rat Traps. Uh, let's see. Here's some Ghostbusters. Bunch of Headless LeBrons. Got the Ecto 1. We got some G.I. Joe stuff. There's the Cobra Hiss. Here's some Power Rangers. Some Spider Man stuff. Some Avatar, got a T'Challa Star Lord, but somebody stole the uh, what is it, the the Watcher's head? Oh, uh, cool! Got the Ezreal Armor Gold Label Batman, and we got the uh, Superman. It's kind of funky looking. What else did I got? The Demon King Shazam. Who else? I think that's it. So that's cool though. Always like seeing these. Uh, let's see, we got some Mission Fleet stuff. We got 
Spider-Man No Way Home, but somebody stole the build the figure part out. Unbelievable. Uh, let's see, here's some Halo stuff. There's Turbo Man's. There's some Masters of the Universe. Here's some of those newer figures. Skeletor, He-Man, Trapjaw. Anybody else? No. Oh, they got some of the new uh, championship shit on two packs. We got the Usos, Triple H and The Rock, Cena and Michaels, Street Profits. Uh, let's see, there's Ray, Bray, Carmella. We got Jungle Boy, Ortiz, a bunch of Scorpio Sky and Frankie Kazarians. Some Brays, there's an Undertaker. So, all right. Well, nothing here, but it's cool to see those DC figures. Um, let's go check out the uh, Neko Funko section and see if anything's over there. Guys, we're here at the Neko Funko section right now. Here's some pops. Some of those Funko Gold figures, aliens, and that is really about it. This place has been ransacked. Ransacked. So, all right, well... I'm going to head back home because, like I said, it's getting late and I got other stuff to do. Um, I want to go eat and I want to get ready for my show tonight with Jan. And, uh, yeah, so I'll be back home in a little bit. I'll show you guys everything that I picked up and we'll go from there. So stick around and stay tuned. All right, guys, and I'm back home. So let's go over what was picked up. So first of all, it was awesome getting to see my buddy. Jorjito, Jorge, the Marvelous Knight. So uh, he was in, like enamored with all the uh, Star Wars stuff we saw at Tate's. But before we dive into that, let's go with what we picked up at Bits and Buttons. He had the Macho King Hasbro figure complete with the crown and the scepter. I couldn't pass it up. So, I mean, you'd be stupid not to because you rarely ever see a complete figure with the accessories, especially from from that time period so here he is right here we got the macho king oh yeah so only thing is i might i might try my hand at doing something i'm not sure um you know obviously because it does need a little bit of touching up so like the wrist tape if you back the wrist tape and the tape on the hands need to be repainted white so i might might just try my hands at it it's it's worth it just to see if i can get it to work so it's you know it's clean and restored and it matches and it looks uniform and good you know and the boots could look the knee pads too and the boots could use a little bit of a touch up too but we got the macho king which is awesome so that'll go nicely in the hasbro cabinet behind me then we went to tate's and i ran into a little bit of a dilemma at tate's um too many things. Too many things I wanted. The Hot Toys cabinet on Star Wars and um, Marvel got restocked. They had Marvel Legends. Um, I know I said I was getting out of Marvel Legends, but there are a few that I want for my personal collection. Um, so decisions were made. Um, I didn't go into specifically what exactly I was buying when I was there, but I will show you what I bought. So first off, no Hot Toys were bought. As much as I wanted that Miles Morales, hopefully they still have it, and maybe I pick it up this weekend, this upcoming following weekend. Who knows? So they had the Miles Morales from the uh, from the new uh, the new set that came out for the uh, Armadillo build a figure. And I had to pick this up because I've seen a whole bunch of people post about this figure. I saw it in person a while a while back, but I didn't grab it. But this is just such an amazing figure. And I really do like the Miles Morales character a lot. So really cool. We got, we got that. Um, then I had sold my What If, my What If series to a buddy of mine. Uh, again, because that was kind of like more of like, I bought it to review it, and then I was just kind of like, what do I do with it now? So I bought that, I sold it to, I just, you know, sold it to a buddy of mine just for retail, what I paid for it. And then 
I saw something else at Tate's that I wanted, but I needed the companion piece to go with it. So we wound up buying back uh, Captain Carter, which I absolutely did love this figure, and, and it's awesome. So we needed Captain Carter for the next figure that we bought. And I know when, in the beginning of the video, when I was initially talking to George about it, I was like, ah, I was like, I don't know if I want to pay that money, because it's it's a little higher than, than most retail places. This is where the dilemma comes in. I'm not a big fan of overpaying for stuff, especially when I deem deem it's not right. Um, they had the figure for like 20 bucks more than, than retail. My only issue is, is that I don't think this figure has ever hit my area yet. And again, it's one of those things that you want to be safe, yet you don't want to be sorry. So I paid the few extra dollars and I bought it. So here it is. I bought the Hydra Stomper. Now, this figure is probably one of the coolest Marvel Legends I've seen yet in person. Um, I can't wait to get this thing on display with Captain Carter, like, riding its back and whatnot. This is just such a badass figure. And it's, it, listen, whether it's What If or whatever Marvel Universe it is, guess what, guys? In some way, shape, or form, this is a Hulkbuster. Whether you want to call it the Hydra or Stomper or not, it's a Hulkbuster. It's basically, like, Hulkbuster 1.0. So... How to, get, how to get this, obviously, for the collection. So, there we go. And, uh, yeah, guys, that is what I picked up for today. Um, I don't know if I'm going to have a lot of time um, to go out tomorrow. Um, I had to run home now because I have to get up to do our first uh, podcast with uh, me and uh, Jan, Captain Powerlift, uh, the World Wrestling Podcast. So, it's going to be our first podcast. Um, so, I'm excited to do that. Excited to bang that out and start that new venture in my... Uh, I guess if you want to call it my social media, YouTube, uh, realm, world, whatever, whatever we live in. So I got to get doing that. So there's a good chance I might go out tomorrow. If I do, obviously you guys will see it. If not, you'll see me right back here. Either way, I'll see you tomorrow. What's popping everybody? It is Sunday morning and we are back on the hunt. And I'm here right now out of uh, Sawgrass Mall. They've got a Lego store in here. There's a Target. Um, I think there's like a Bucks a Million in here too. So uh, we're gonna go inside and uh, see what they got and see if we can uh, find anything cool. I'm interested to see what's in the Lego store because I know there's some new stuff comes out, but you know, the, obviously the store gets it before Target and Walmart does. So uh, yeah, let's go inside and check it out. All right guys, we're here right now outside of the Lego store. Lego store! And uh, we're gonna go inside and see what they got. That's cool, they got the pickup truck, the world map, the police station. Oh, there it is. The tumbler. Oh, I think so cool. 2,049 pieces. That is so cool. There's the uh, 89 Batmobile, the Batwing, the space shuttle. Oh, the Mar Super Mario block, that's cool. Here's the Coliseum, Super Nintendo, or no, regular Nintendo, sorry. Porsche. Oh, that's cool. The soccer stadium. Oh, the Home Alone set. There you go. That's cool. The Fender. Got Stranger Things. Oh, that's cool. The Haunted House. Uh, here's some Technic stuff. There's the Ferrari. Dump truck. Oh, they got the Batmobile. Shit, I might have to grab that. That's cool. Uh, we got the uh, Lambo. Got the Land Rover. Uh, see, we got some Minecraft stuff. Here's the A Wing, the R2, the Millennium Falcon. There's the Imperial Star Destroyer, which is cool. Uh, let's see. Here's some of the bus. Uh, they got a cantina. What else do they got? Um, Imperial Shuttle, Bad Batch Ship. Uh, Hogwarts Icon Collection, that's pretty cool with the owl. That's actually a pretty cool set. Wow, 3,000 pieces? And they got Harry Potter's wands. Um, over here. 
We got some of the internals. Got the Infinity Saga stuff, the Dragon Flyer, Sanctuary. We have the Guardian ship. Uh, they got Spider-Man No Way Home stuff. This Vulture and Spider-Man. Here's the uh, the Batcave. That's cool. Smaller version of the Batmobile. The Mini Tumbler. That's cool. So, uh, let me see what else that I got. Uh, pretty much, that's about it. So, all right. Um, I'm going to continue to look around. There are two things that I'm highly interested in. One, obviously, that Technic uh, Batmobile and the Tumbler. I don't know which one I want. So, uh, yeah, let's continue to take a look around. And uh, if I buy anything, I'll let you know. If not, I'll see you at the next place. All right, guys, so I'm deciding about Lego stuff, but we're here right now outside of Books A Million. So we're going to go inside and see what they got. So here's some figures right now. Got some DC stuff, so here's Dr. Fate, the Armored Batman, the Robin King. Uh, there's the Hyper Real Luke, but I think people are saying that these are showing up at Ollie's. There's Bendy's, there's Karate Kid, there's Grandmaster and Korg. There's some Dune stuff. Let me see what's on the other side. We got some Diamond Select, Squirrel Girl, Death Strike, The Thing. Um, the Bat Raptor, it's John Wick, um, there's some Black Series figures, there's some Marvel Legends, we got Shang-Chi, Fantastic Four, there's the Karate Kid figures, the Battle Damage, Johnny, and I think what, yeah, they just have Johnny, no Daniel, um, Here's some Power Rangers, some Ghostbusters, some more Diamond Select. There's the uh, the Pimp Daddy Destro. Um, and they got some Pops. Over here they got the, uh, the Hydra Stomper, which we picked him up yesterday. Yeah! Um, some Turtle stuff. Uh, I don't know what half of this other stuff is. This Crockett and Tubbs. It's gummy bears. Uh, let's see. Golden Girls. Disneyland. Oh, they got the Razor. Uh, let's see. Got Wonder Woman's. I think that's really about it for the most part. So, all right. Well, pretty cool. So, all right. Um, I be believe. The next place is a GameStop, I think. So we'll go check that out. All right, guys, we're here right now outside of a GameStop. Let's go inside and see what they have because I haven't been inside one in a hot minute. I don't really see much of anything. There's Imperial Rocket Troopers. Oh, there's the uh, Zalabar, the Gaming Greats. Uh, see anybody else? And we got the Flame Trooper. Seems to be about it. We got Quill and Grief and Gideon, and that's all they really got for figures. That's actually kind of disappointing. Here's some pops, but nothing special to write home about, so. Oh, that, is, that is actually kind of disappointing that that is all they got for fucking figures. I mean, Jesus GameStop, step up the... Uh, Step up the game a little bit. Uh, here's some statues and stuff. So they got a First Order helmet, Punisher War Machine helmet. There's the Pink Ranger helmet. Uh, there's the uh, PCS, uh, PVC version of uh, Bebop. And then there's a uh, Iron Man. So, all right. Um, I believe I'm holding out Last Hope, and that is for the target that's attached to the small. So, uh, Let's go ahead that way and see if they got anything. Guys, so we're coming into the target right now that's attached to this mall. So let's go inside and see if they got anything. As we're down to figure out right now, here's some Jurassic World stuff. There's John Hammond. We got Dr. Ellie 
Stadler, there's the Tyrannosaurus Rex pack that Diamond Dave picked up not too long ago. Um, let's see, here's some Masters of the Universe stuff. Uh, we've got Skeletor, He Man, some Origins, some Ghostbusters. We've got uh, the Wind Raider. Uh, let's see, there's some Ghostbusters, some Mission Fleet. We've got Brett Baker's, but no Chase. Uh, we got Vega, Ripley, Garza, McIntyre. Uh, there's Billy Gunn, JYD. We've got Sid Justice. There's the LGN, LJN Cody. Uh, let's see what's on the other side. Uh, let's see. Here's some Marvel Legends. We got uh, Crow over here. Um, got some of the three and three quarters. That's about it. I have no idea what those things are. Excuse me. Uh, let's see. Here's some G.I. Joe. They got, looks like just Snake Eyes. Some Transformers. They got uh, such Shadow Panther. Rhinox, Cyclonus. Uh, here's some of the multiverse stuff. There's the Bat Cycle. Flash, Battle Damaged. Batman uh, let's see you know somebody asked me to go check the Lego section let's see what's see what's going on down the Lego section so let's see we got R2 Gogru Bad Batch um, at at here's the uh, Mario stuff here's some of the internals Venom Batman Gauntlet there's some of the new McFarlane ones. I think that's about it. Some Jurassic Park stuff, and here's the uh, the blacksmith, the Sesame Street house. So, all right, I'm striking out today. Uh, let's go check out and see what's over in the NECA Funko section. We're here at the NECA Funko section right now. Here's some Magic, some King Kong, Friday the Thirteenth, some Toonie Terrors. All the usual stuff we see, Dune, there's Chrome Dome, some Spawn, there's Violator, Game of Thrones. Uh, that's kind of about it, man. I was expecting this NECA Funko section to be a little bigger, but I guess not. So, all right, well, um, let me figure out where I'm going to head next. I might go back to the Lego store and grab something, not 100% sure still feeling that out but uh yeah either way uh, i'll see you guys in a minute all right guys and i'm back home so i had a pretty fun relaxing day today hanging out with my family at the mall um obviously you didn't see them on camera but uh we had a lot of fun uh we were looking for sneakers for the kids but i know once we were at that mall um you know there's stores there so we went into the lego store I was so torn between the UCS Tumblr and the new Batmobile from the new Batman movie that I was just like, you know what? I've got enough Legos to build right now at the moment. Um, let's let's take it easy on the Legos. As much as I want them, they will be bought. I promise you they will be bought, just not right now. Um, you know, and then we went into uh, GameStop and Books A Million, and we also went into, um, where was it, the other place? See, oh, there was a Target there. So nothing nothing really like I'm like oh, I gotta run out and go get nah. so yeah that's basically it guys so you know again we're gonna have days where we go out and we don't find anything and you know that happens a little bit more commonly these days than than used to uh just because I've narrowed down what I'm collecting and I'm just not going hard on a lot of things right now so uh yeah all right, guys, and that is going to wrap up another hunt video for this week. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I hope you guys liked the Marvel Legends stuff I picked up. That Hydra Stomper, I'm absolutely smitten over. And, of course, who can forget the Macho King? Oh, yeah! So, um, you know, and next week's a new week, so we'll see what it brings us then. Also, guys, do not forget to check out the World Wrestling Podcast. I will leave the link in the description below for the channel. I'll also leave the link in the description below for the Spotify channel. Um, please... I appreciate if you guys can come and support the channel and also support on Spotify. Um, you know, again, this is a passion project. I really want to try to build this thing and, and I really want to try to make something out of it. So any support you guys can give me, again, it's just a simple thumbs up or subscribing or whatnot. 
much much appreciated and you know me i'm not normally one to ask for that type of stuff but you know again please if you don't mind <laughs> also guys don't forget this saturday november 13th the eight hour live lego mega build stream is happening happening so george will be building the superstar destroyer i will be building the daily bugle um i believe junior is going to be joining us and he's going to be building something and then there's a few other people that might pop in as well um i don't know exactly what time we're going to start it but i'm going to talk to george hopefully it'll be like a 9 a.m start time and uh, we'll go from there. So with that being said, if you guys like what you saw, please be sure to give a thumbs up. If you're new, please be sure to subscribe. As always, be sure to hit that bell so you get notified every time another episode of What's Popping gets uploaded for your viewing pleasure. As always, you can check out all the excellent content we always offer right here at MCE. And until next time, guys, that's What's Popping.